Hi, I'm Alex from Young Education and today I'm going to do a short clip on how to differentiate and integrate sine and cosine. So I'm often asked when you're differentiating sine and cos, how can we remember which one goes to positive and which one goes to negative? So here's my tip. Draw a circle, sine, cos, negative sine, negative cos. When you're differentiating, you go clockwise. So in other words, when I'm differentiating sine, I get cos. When I differentiate cos, I get negative sine. When I differentiate negative sine, I get negative cos. And when I differentiate negative cos, I get sine. And then you can just keep going. As we all know, integration is the reverse process of differentiation. So therefore, we're going to go anti-clockwise. So when you're integrating, integrating sine gives you negative cos. The integral of negative cos gives you negative sine. The integral of negative sine gives you cos. And the integral of cos gives you sine. All you then need to remember is the circle and which way you're going. Differentiation clockwise, integration anti-clockwise. Top tip. Thank you for watching and I hope that helps. If you have any questions at all or even a subject that you want me to cover, please feel free to email me on info at youngeducation.co.uk or alternatively leave a message below.